ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਸੋ ਵੈਲਕਮ ਟੂ ਆਲ ਦ ਸੰਗਤ ਟੁਡੇ ਇਜ਼ 16th ਆਫ ਜੂਨ ਅਕੋਰਡਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਦ ਮੂਨ ਨਾਨਸ਼ਾਈ ਕੈਲੰਡਰ ਅਮ ਦ 2003 ਨਾਨਸ਼ਾਈ ਕੈਲੰਡਰ ਦਾ ਇਸ ਗੁਰੂ ਅਰਜਨ ਦੇਵ ਜੀ ਸ਼ੀਦੀ ਦੈਨ ਮਾਰਟਮ ਡੇ ਅਮ ਲੋਟ ਦ ਸੰਗਤ ਅਮ ਮਾਰਕਡ ਥਿਸ ਡੇ ਐਟ ਦ ਐਂਡ ਆਫ ਮਈ ਐਜ਼ ਵੈਲ um according to the bikrami calendar as well so um any time to remember the guru um pay tribute to the guru is always a blessed time so today uh, some children have really nice made some made some really nice videos um which will be sharing with the sangat um so bahut sare niyane ne gurur jandev ji maharaj de shiddi devis nu mukh rakh de ohna ne video banaya uh je kisne if somebody wish to participate if you kindly just uh, send a message or a comment of who you are where you from and what you wish to present first so also when we can do plan so ranjit singh ji je tusi apna age uh tusi kitho ha ta tusi ki pesh karna chande what would you like to present um then uh, that would be appreciated thik hai ji bahut dhanwad thank you very much to everybody uh so um is we try to uh, do this program uh aimed at children but it's for everybody but we try to aim it for children um so we will speak the most time um english so english is jyada bolunge kyunki chote bachche jehde unnu vi samajh aa jaye khaas kar ke punjabi kat mukh jira khaas program hai bachcha vaste banaya gaya ta par je koi vadde vi hissa lena chahunde aa ta koi ek sawal puchna chahunde welcome ya so as the sangat is joining us we we'll just do uh, mool mantra da jap and then we'll uh, stop with uh, today's uh, special program which is going to be about guru arjan dev ji maharaj so if you put your hands together we we'll do mool mantra da jap ek ankar sat naam karta pur nirpa nirvair akal murat ajuni sabam gur prasad ek ankar sat naam karta pur nirpo nirvair akal murat ajuni sabang gur prasad ik ankar sat naam karta pur nirpo nirvair akal murat ajuni sabang gur prasad ik ankar sat naam karta pur nirpo nirvai akal murat ajuni sabang gur prasad and last time ek ankar sat naam karta pur nirpo nirvai akal murat ajuni sabang gur prasad vai guru ji ka khalsa vai guru ji ki fateh so we'll be sharing some uh, facts about guru arjan dev ji maharaj um, and uh, uh, we'll also be sharing some stories about guru arjan dev ji maharaj before we come to uh, share with the sangat um, what happened when guru arjan dev ji maharaj ji um, became shaheed when he sacrificed his life um so we're going to start with a video from javeer singh so um we just going to go to his video which he is sent in um uh, there we go guys ji ki khas awaaz ji ki pata guru arjan dev ji is the fifth guru guru arjan dev ji was born in 1563 guru ji's father name was guru ram das ji and his mother's name was bibi bani ji Guru Arjan Dev Ji had two elder brothers by Jiki Khasa Wajki Pate. Mother's name was So both on what so that was Jaivi Singh from Banbury who shared so some basic facts about Guru Arjan Dev Ji or when Guru Arjan Dev Ji was born who were Guru Arjan Dev Ji's parents so guru ramdas ji the fourth or fourth pasha guru ramdas ji the pita ji si ta guru ramdas ji maharaj de mata ji bibi bhani ji si and as jai vee said he had uh, two elder brothers one of the two vadde bhrata san ta vadde sab to vadde jehde si the eldest was baba prithi chand ji and ohna to chote young and baba prithi chand was baba mahadev ji so esi maharaj de vadde jehde do bhra si maharaj is two elder brothers and guru arjan dev ji maharaj sab the chote son guru arjan dev ji was the youngest of the three siblings uh, 
um, of Guru Ram Das Ji. So now we're going to go to um, Gorkor uh, from Banbury, who has very nicely um, sent in a video of some more facts about Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj. <laughs> Made the city of Tanatanan Sahib. Guru Arjun Dev Ji wrote the first Guru Granth Sahib Ji, which was called Ard Granth Ji, and also Putti Sahib. Guru Arjun Dev Ji made the building of the city Durba. Saif in Amrit Sun, which not not sick called the Golden Temple. Why could you Why could you Why could you Okay, so is he um Bachi Gurkor? So um from Banbury, Jenani Bosonane Samjaya, Gwarjan Deji Maharaj, um some of the things that they blessed and gave us. So Guru um Arjan Deji Maharaj, Unane Shahri Vasayasi, he made cities. Uh Tarantaran Sar Amrasar was actually made into a a big city with lots of shops. Guru Arjan Dev Ji invited people to come and live in Amritsar, but not just to live, but also to do business. So people were coming, they were selling things, buying things, and it became a place, and it basically Amritsar came on the map. It was a place where people wanted to, to, to come to either do business or to stay, um, and it became very popular. Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj also gave us a really big gift of Gurbani which Gurkor told us as well. So thank you very much um, Gurkor for sharing a few things that Guru Arjan Deji Maharaj blessed us with. So if anybody would like to participate in today's special show which will just we're going to keep the topic of Guru Arjan Deji Maharaj that if anybody would like to um, either read a poem, read a Shabbat or share a story if you're especially um, a younger one um, or you would like to ask a question, you can ask a question just by typing but if any khas karke in particular if you want to ask a small child or want to ask a small child or want to ask a small child or want to ask then if you kindly just leave um, a comment um, saying who you are, what age you are um, and what you want to do and then we can uh, yeah, go live with you as well so now we've got um, Amriya Kaur from Banbury and she has very nicely recorded, if I can find, oh, for some reason, where's where she gone? Amriya Kaur's, okay, we're just going to get a video from my group. Sorry, Sangaji, just um, getting the video of um, Amriya Kaur. Oh, for some reason, it's not um, showing up. Okay, let me see if I can um, come up now. Ooh, okay, we'll try, uh, try one more time to see if we can get Amriya Kaur's video up. Okay, let's try one more time. Will it show? For some reason it's not, so sorry. Perhaps we will put that on, on YouTube, Amriya Kaur's video. So Amriya Kaur had um, made a video about Asaki, about Guru Arjun, uh, well, she had read Asaki about Guru Arjun Dev Ji Maharaj and the Sangat from Kabul. So sorry about that. Um, what we do is we're going to now, oh, let me put this back on the stand. Why Guru Ji? Oh, that's better. So we'll go into reasons um, why Guru Arjun Dev Ji Maharaj was arrested and what happened afterwards, okay? So for today, we've got some nice pictures to help us to go through the story. So let's go and pick the pictures. Okay. So during Guru Arjun Dev Ji Maharaj's time, uh, the first of all, the emperor used to be called somebody called Akbar. So Akbar died in 1605. Akbar was a quite nice person and he respected all religions and all peoples. Akbar jada si sare tarma da satkar karda si ta vaise o changa insaan si. Par ki hunda that Jahan Akbar wanted to make his grandson the emperor. O apne pote nu badshah banana chahunda si. However, Akbar's elder son, ja sorry, Akbar's son, Jahangir, sorry, he, he wasn't very keen on making his son the emperor and wanted to become an emperor. 
But Akbar didn't want him to become the emperor because he wasn't a very nice person. He was a nasty person and he didn't think he would do a very good job. So, but Jahangir didn't take any notice of what his father wanted. His father dies and rather than uh, the prince Khusro become the king, Jahangir sat on the throne and he even tried to kill his own son at that point. So his uh, son has a battle with him, um, but he wasn't very successful, so he had to run away from his dad, and Jahangiri becomes the emperor. So that's just something to keep in mind, and now we're going to talk about what Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj Ji blessed us uh, with. Right, so during Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj Ji's time, many people became sick, and these are some of the examples. So you've got by Lagaji, by Manjji, Sai Mia Mirji, many people became followers of the, of the Guru. So people, Sikhi was becoming really, really popular. Many, many people are becoming the followers of, of Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, and they loved the way of life of Sikhi. They loved Gurbani, and even today, many people who are not Perhaps they have not become six, but they love to go to the Gurdwara Sahib, they love to read Gurbani, and they love to have Maharaji's Darshan. Darshan means to see the Guru. So, Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj Ji, his message was that he, he, he shared that all humans should be treated with respect and dignity, that all of us should be treated um, with, with the decency. Um, and you can see in this picture here, this lady here wants to get some water. So she wants some water, however, she's not allowed to come too close to the lady. And the reason being is not because she is unhygienic, um, it's not because she is unclean, she may have had a shower. It's nothing to do with the, her way of life um, or what she believes. It might be she's a saint, it could be that she's a very good person who does um, acts very godly and actually f worships God. However, the reason why she's not allowed to come close is because the family she's born in. So according to the Hindu religion, that people who are born in certain families were considered low and people born in other families were considered high. And so these people, that was just based on the jobs their families did and people couldn't change their jobs. So it wasn't very nice saying that someone's low or high because of their jobs. Yeah, if somebody does bad things, they become a bad person. Good things makes them a good person. But they weren't very interested in that. It was just based on what family they were born in. So Gurarjan Dev Ji, he actually spoke up against this. Gurarjan Dev Ji Maharaj blessed us with Gurbani. But not only did he bless us with the Gurbani, he collected all the Gurbani from all the previous Gurus. So that's Guru Nanak Dev Ji, Guru Angad Dev Ji, Guru Amar Das Ji, Guru Ram Das Ji, and also the Bani of Guru Arjan Dev Ji, which he had writ written himself as well. Gurbani is how Vahe Guruji spoke to us. Vahe Guruji gave us his words and he said these words by coming in a human body in the form of the Guru and sharing us these special words. But not only was it the Gurus which gave us this Gurbani, it was also um, special saints or holy men who were called Bhagats. So their Gurbani was also collected by Guru Arjan Dev Ji and Guru Arjan Dev Ji put them all into a special scripture, a special Granth. And that Granth, as Guru told us uh, at the beginning of the program, was called Ad Granth Sahib Ji. Ad means the first. It was the first holy scripture of the six or is also called Bhati Sahib. So this was amazing because it allowed people that we can find out about Vai Guruji, we can talk to Vai Guruji and we can listen to Vai Guruji without somebody else taking money from us or somebody else being cruel to us or nasty to us or even some people becoming, being so nasty saying that you are not allowed to know anything about God because you come from a low from a low caste family, you come from a lowly family. So Gurbani made it very easy for everybody and anybody to find out more about how lovely Vai Guruji is. So that was one thing which was given. Um, so Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj not only gave us Gurbani, not only did he speak against the caste system of being cruel um, and mistreating people because of the families who were born in, but Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj also went himself um, to the people and did seva. So how did he do seva? He went, when he went to the people, he gave them food because there was a famine. Famine means being 
that um, a lot of people were going hungry and people were dying, a bit like people are now with the coronavirus. So at that time, during Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj's lifetime, there was a famine. People were going hungry and people becoming very sick. But Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, he went outside and he took his six and he fed the hungry. He helped the sick people. Uh, uh, has a good time. Uh, I has a good time. 34 minutes. Oh. I don't know if that Gurmeet Kaur Benji um, sent a message, sorry. Uh, if you can just kindly, Benji, just send that message, it didn't make sense to me. Thank you. Um, so, Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, um, he helped these sick people. And you can see in this picture with his own hands. And these are people which are a lot of time forgotten because they were, because they were considered lowly people, people who are poor people, and people didn't go near them. But Guru Arjan Dev Ji didn't mind if they were sick or if they were poor, he helped them all. So Guru Arjan Dev Ji became very popular and people loved him. That Rai Guru Ji has come on this earth as Guru Arjan Dev Ji in helping us. So what else did Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj bless us with? These two very important words called Pangat and Sangat. So what does Pangat mean? Pangat means when we sit in rows and on the floor and we have langar. And Sangat is when we all sit together and we listen to Gurbani or do Simran. So you can see when Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj blessed us with Pangat and Sangat, as you can see in the pictures, everybody is sitting on the floor as equals. No one is given a special treatment. No one is considered low, lowlier than others. No one's treated as more special than others. Everybody sits together and treated as as equal humans. So this was amazing that where society, where the other, the other religious traditions at that time or the rulers were dividing people, Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj just reminded us all that we're all human beings, we're all the children of God, whether you're rich, whether you're poor, whether you're one religion or another religion, that we're all Vai Guru Ji's children and Vai Guru Ji loves all of us. So what happens next? Now, Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj wasn't very popular um, um, in the eyes of the Emperor. The Emperor had a lot of supporters or people who used to advise him who, who weren't very happy with Guru Arjan Dev Ji because they believed that um, India should have, it should be the empire, uh, the empire of the Mughals should only have one religion and only one religion should be allowed, uh, allowed and no other religion. So Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, they, did, they didn't like that a lot of people were becoming Sikhs and that Guru Arjan Dev Ji's message was so popular with everybody. So Jahangir wanted an excuse to stop Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj and to stop people from becoming Sikhs so that he could please his supporters who only wanted one religion and they believed that no other religion has the right to exist and no other community should have the right to exist. So what was the excuse? So he mentioned before that Khusro is something you can see the picture at the bottom. He was supposed to become the emperor, but instead the, the, the father, Jahangir, he forced himself to become the emperor and he tried to uh, have, fight with his son, his son had to, son had to uh, run away. When his son ran away, he ran uh, away from the capital, which was Delhi, and he ran towards Punjab and he was going to go beyond there. But what happens is, that he gets captured by his, by his father's army and he's sadly killed. But not only was he killed, as you can see in the picture, his followers and his soldiers were also, they were killed and their dead bodies were shown around Delhi to scare people. Now, Jahangir had needed an excuse to arrest Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj. So what does he do? He accuses that Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj blessed his son Khusro and he gave and he and he gave him langar and he and he also said that if he needs the help of the six the six will help him so jahangir said that anybody who helped his son who he didn't like that he's going to punish them so that was an excuse but really um it was there was a made up it wasn't real so guru arjan dev ji under this false accusation that he was arrested by Jahangir on the 22nd of May 1606 and for five days Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj is then tortured. 
So what would these torches include? Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj Ji was boiled. Before this, um, I've got to mention that Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj was given some choices. Aha, this is the slide I was looking for. So the choices that Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj was given was that he can change Gurbani, change the word of God, that by changing Guru Granth Sahib Ji Maharaj, which was then called Ad Granth Upati Sahib, that he would let him go free, he would excuse him. Or he could pay a fine, so a really, 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 really expensive fine. So imagine all that money of all the Sikhs who work really hard and they're given money to Guru Arjan Dev Ji. Jangi wanted to get his hands on that. But Guru Arjan Dev Ji said, I can't change the word of Vaheguru and nor will I give you the hard earned money of the Sikhs for something uh, which I've not done. I, because you know, you're just being greedy and you're full of anger and hatred. So he said the other option Guru Arjan Dev Ji has is to give up Sikhi and to become the same religion as Jahangir, the emperor. But Guru Arjan Dev Ji Mara says that he will not give up Sikhi. So then he was actually tortured as we've seen in this picture. So Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj was kept hungry. Uh, he was given no water, kept in the sun. Uh, it was very hot, as you can imagine, May and June. And then Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, he, he, he was still alive, even though it was boiled. Imagine hot water being poured on you and your body would get so many blisters. So Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj then, which you've probably seen many pictures, that Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, his whole body was full of blisters. Imagine his body, he's been all boiled and all the skin is very, looking very, 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 very soft. It's looking very poorly. And Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj was then made to sit on a hot iron plate. So a tava is when we make rotiya on at home. That's called a tava, the hot iron plate. And a really, really big one is called Tavi. So Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj in Tavi te bataya gaya, Tati Tavi te bataya gaya si on a hot iron plate. Ta not only did he sit on the hot iron plate, Ubal da reta upar paaya gaya si, boiling hot sand was poured on top of Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj. So when hot boiling sand is put on, imagine it's quite salty as well, sand. So it was going into Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj's wounds and the skin was coming off as well. It's a very, very painful torture that Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj has given. However, Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj in his Bani says, Olano me kahu na dio, I don't blame anybody. I don't curse anybody. I don't blame anybody. Guru Arjan Dev Ji says, so Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj says that I accept what Vaheguru Ji does sweetly. So Guru Arjan Dev Ji taught us to always stay positive. Even though Guru Arjan Dev Ji is being tortured, he is not saying anything bad to anybody. And instead of Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, he is saying that Vaheguru Ji da We should accept what Vaheguru Ji does as sweet as good. So what happens next? Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, after this, According to uh, a historian called Kesar Singh Shibbar, so in here you can see, I've put the quote there for those who can read Punjabi. So he writes, um, and I've given the Bansavli Nama and the page reference. According to Kesar Singh Shibbar, Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, he doesn't become Shaheed, he doesn't leave his body um, while sitting on the Tati Tavi, while sitting on the hot iron plate. What happens is Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj is brought outside and outside you can see in the picture um, so that's now Gurdara Dera Sahib in Lahore where Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj was tortured and outside was a river, Punjabi which river is called Nadi. So Ejri Nadi si Nadi the naam si Ravi. So the name of the river is Ravi. And Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj was brought outside next to the river and they realized that Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, nor is he willing to do what Jahangir wants him to do, nor is he willing to change Gurbani, nor is he willing to give money of the hard and money of the Sikhs, nor is Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj willing to give up his Sikhi, and nor has Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj 
as he um, given up his body um, on the hot iron plate. So they decided, the soldiers, to throw stones at Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj. According to Kesar Singh, this historian, which is a quote, according to this quote, um, it's not usually, it's, we have sometimes in the Gurdwara Sahib, when people are sharing this story, it might be that they have some variations depending on the books they would read. According to this quote, what happened is Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj had two stones thrown at him. And when the second stone hit his forehead, it hit a blister and Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj Ji left his body. When Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj left his body, uh, the, according to the historian Kesar Singh Shibbar, that Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj was, was body was put into the river and no one ever saw that body. And it's quite amazing how Guru Nanak Dev Ji Maharaj's body disappeared and no one saw. Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj's body disappeared and no one saw. And Guru Gobind Singh Ji Maharaj's body disappeared and, never, and no one saw it. So and one message we can try to take from that is that the Guru is t teaching us that the Guru never dies. The Guru always lives and that the body um, is less important, but the more important is the jyot, the light, the living guru who is in the body, which is Vai Guruji speaking. And that living guru uh, changed body from Guru Arjan Dev Ji's body into Guru Har Gobind Sahib Ji's body, the sixth guru. And that same light, the same guru lived on, and eventually that guru's light, that guru who is alive, came into Guru Granth Sahib Ji Maharaj. So, if we're going to sum up, Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj Shahidi, Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj is martyrdom. You can see in this this uh, uh, illustration, um, try to show you the, the the key message of this. So on one side you got Nyarapan, uniqueness. That as six we are unique with Gurbani, we are unique uh, with the with the, the lovely teachings. Our Guru is unique. So there's uniqueness that we decide to follow God's path and not the world's path. And then on the other side is Qurbani sacrifice and Sikhi and you can see the bridge in between is Sikhi. So in order to keep Sikhi, to keep its Niyarapan, to keep the Sikhi as special, many Gursikhs uh, gave Shahidi, they gave sacrifices, Qurbaniya. And the reason why they gave Qurbani because Guru Arjan Dev Ji was a role model who showed that Sikhi is so special that for Sikhi, even giving up your life is a small price to pay. Um, if we don't give Qurbani, Guru Arjan Dev Ji, um, imagine if, uh, if that history was not there, then we would have become diluted, malavat, uh, meaning we just mix in with the rest of the world and we get destroyed. But Guru Arjan Dev Ji didn't do that. Guru Arjan Dev Ji said, never mix in and, and let go of, of who you are and become like the rest of the world and, and lose yourself. Rather, keep your special path of God, the special path of Vai Guruji, and if that means Qurbani, then do so as well. So that was in short, the Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj Shirdi. Um, and we got a nice message from Pai Vijay Singh to share with the Sangat um, before we come towards an end. Then if anybody wants to ask a question, if any families are watching, if any of parents, you've got children there, Khas uh, Karki would like to give time for children. If you want to give a child, 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 if we'd like to just share a sakhi, a short sakhi about Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, then more than welcome. If you just kindly just write your name in a comment, uh, your age, um, that you'd like to say something, and then we'll make sure we'll um, give you time. So, I'm going to go to a video of, from Pai Vijay Singh Ji, who uh, very kindly shares his message. Wahiguru Ji Ka Khalsa, Wahiguru Ji Ki Fateh. So, today we remember the Shahidi of Guru Arjan Dev Ji. Guru Sahib is known as the Shahid Da Sirtaj, meaning the master of all the Shahids. When we think of Shahidi, we think of Guru Arjun Dev Ji sitting on that hot iron plate and having that hot sand poured on them. Now, what I want to do over the next few minutes is just to look at some important lessons we can learn from, learn from Guru Arjun Dev Ji Shahidi. The first one is be prepared to speak the truth. Guru Arjan Dev Ji went around spreading the message of Sikhi. Guru Sahib didn't twist Sikhi. Guru Sahib didn't change Sikhi just to sue others. Guru Sahib wanted to 
educate people about how they can reach Vaiguru. Guru Sahib wanted to help people get out of the practices that they were practicing. Many of them were doing lots of superstitious things. And Guru Sahib wanted to get them out of that. Now this draws, drew some very, very bad attention. So message number two is that, or lesson number two is that, when you are spreading the truth, when you are speaking the truth, you're going to have enemies. Now, Guru Sahib had many enemies. Why? Because there were many, many egotistical people, people with lots of ego, people with lots of anger, which weren't happy, uh, who weren't happy with Guru Arjun Dev Ji about how he was um, uh, talking about Sikhi and how he was um, uh, amazing people with the, with the message of Sikhi. They thought that our, our followers are going to go down. So we have to put a stop to the Guru. So Guru Sahib's third and final message that I want to um, share here is that if you live the truth and you speak the truth, you have to be willing to die for the truth. Now, when Guru Sahib was on that hot iron plate, Guru Sahib could have been saved easily. Guru Sahib could have saved himself. Guru Sahib was all powerful. But at the same time, there was Sai Miami there who had an army of thousands who, was, who were prepared to save, uh, take Guru Sahib off uh, that, that tabi and destroy the army that was there. But Guru Sahib said, no, you do a das for me. And this is a message here to teach people that if you, are, if you want to tell the truth, or if you want to live a righteous life, then these, th this may be the consequence that you have to face. But you never, ever compromise your principles. You never, never turn your back against the Guru, and you never, never turn your back against the truth. So these are the th three things that we can learn from Guru Arjun Dev Ji Shahidi. Why Guru Ji Ka Khalsa? Why Guru Ji Ki Fateh? So thank you very much to Pai Vijay Singh Ji, who took time out today uh, to share his views as well about Guru Arjun Dev Ji Maharaj Shahidi. Uh, so, um, thank you to Raj Dev Singh uh, Ji who uh, said, despite everything, Maharaj had the most love for Vaheguru. Um, thank you for sharing that. Um, so, there was a few people who, in the beginning of the program, wished to uh, share something. I think they were trying to, but if you, if you, anybody wishes to share any questions or you would just like to share some about Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, or if there's any children who would like to participate, or um, you're more than welcome, we've got time now. So if you just um, shout out, and um, we'll give, give you time. Um, so Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, Shahidi, um, imagine how hot it was at that time, and sometimes we're feeling the, hot, the heat today as well. Um, it's very hot today as well. But imagine Guru Arjan Dev how cool he, he stayed. And you think about how cool. So when we were to cool ourselves down, some people eat ice cream, some people cool themselves by drinking cold water, some people cool themselves down with ice, um, some people cool themselves down by taking off um, a jacket or a jumper uh, or a sweater. Um, how did Arjun Dev Ji Maharaj stay cool uh, even though the weather was hot, the, the iron plate, the tavi was hot, the fire underneath it was hot, the people around Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj with, were, were hot with, with anger, but Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj remained cool. And the, the, how he's remained cool was through Gurbani and through Simran. So Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, that's how he remained cool. Um, I just remember we have a video from Jyot Kaur, um, who is really nice, he made a real huge effort. She herself has um, summarized Guru Arjan Dev Maharaj Shiddi in her own words um, in Punjabi. So we're gonna just, for a minute or so, just listen to Jyot Kaur um, before we continue with the rest of the show. Vai good day ka khalsa, vai good ji ki fateh. Tera kiya me ta lagge, her naam padarit nanak mange. Your action seems so sweet to me. Nanak begs for the treasure of the naam, the naam of the Lord. Shahida de Sataj, Panjami Pacha, Guru Arjun Dev ji da janam, Chote Pacha, Guru Ram Das ji de kar, Mata Bibi Pani ji de kukko. Pandra so trend is vinu govind wal vikhe hoya. Guru Arjun Dev Sahib ji da suba shuru tohi sitil sanjam at naam bani vich range at guru pita ji de agya vich chalan wala si. Pandra so ekasi is vi vich Guru Arjun Dev ji nu gurgaddi bakshke si. 
ਗੁਰੂ ਅਰਜਨ ਦੇਵ ਜੀ ਸਾਰਿਆਂ ਦੇ ਗੁਰੂ ਸਨ ਪਰ ਕੁਝ ਲੋਕ ਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਨੂੰ ਪਸੰਦ ਨਹੀਂ ਕਰਦੇ ਸਨ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਲੋਕਾਂ ਵਿੱਚ ਇੱਕ ਸਮਰਾਟ ਜਹਾਂਗੀਰ ਸੀ ਜਹਾਂਗੀਰ ਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਤੋਂ ਈਰਖਾ ਕਰਦਾ ਸੀ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਬਹੁਤ ਸਾਰੇ ਲੋਕ ਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਦੇ ਦੱਸੇ ਹੋਏ ਰਸਤੇ ਤੇ ਚੱਲਦੇ ਸਨ ਜਹਾਂਗੀਰ ਨੇ ਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਨੂੰ ਕਿਫਤਾਰ ਖਰਨ ਅਤੇ ਪੰਜ ਦਿਨਾਂ ਦੇ ਤਸੀਹੇ ਦੇਖੇ ਰੱਖਣ ਦਾ ਹੁਕਮ ਦਿੱਤਾ ਪੰਜ ਦਿਨਾਂ ਦੇ ਤਸੀਹੇ ਨਾ ਕੁਝ ਖਾਨ ਪੀਣ ਨੂੰ ਦਿੱਤਾ ਉਬਲ ਦੇ ਪਾਣੀ ਵਿੱਚ ਅਤੇ ਤੱਤੀ ਥਵੀ ਤੇ ਬਿਠਾਇਆ ਇਸ ਸਾਰੇ ਸਮੇਂ ਦੌਰਾਨ ਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਸਿਮਰਨ ਕਰਦੇ ਰਹੇ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਓ ਸੋ ਵੰਡਰਫੁਲ ਸੋ ਦੈਟ ਵਾਸ ਜੋਤ ਕੌਰ ਹੀ ਬਹੁਤ ਸੋਹਣੀ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਆ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਵਿੱਚ ਆਪ ਲਿਖ ਕੇ ਪੜ ਕੇ ਸੁਣਾਇਆ ਸੋ ਦੀਸ ਛੋਟ ਹੂ ਆਰ ਲਰਨਿੰਗ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਆ ਮਾਰਸ ਕਿਰਪਾ ਦੇ ਵੀਰੀ ਵਾਲ ਤੇ ਬਲਮ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਨੰਬਰਸ ਐਂਡ ਇਨ ਪਰਟਿਕੂਲਰ ਜੋਤ ਕੌਰ ਐਂਡ ਹਰ ਸਿਸਟਰ ਦੇ ਹੈਵ ਬੀਨ ਗੋਇੰਗ ਟੂ ਦ ਹਿਮ ਕੌਂਟ ਕੰਪੀਟੀਸ਼ਨ ਵਿਚ ਦ ਚਿਲਡਰਨ ਗੈਟ ਟੂਗੇਦਰ ਐਂਡ ਚਿਲਡਰਨ ਰਾਈਟ ਸਪੀਚਸ ਔਨ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਟੌਪਿਕਸ ਔਨ ਸਿੱਖੀ ਸੋ ਦੇ ਗਿਵਨ ਮਟੀਰੀਅਲ ਟੂ ਰੀਡ ਐਂਡ ਇਫ ਯੂ ਰੀਡ ਔਨ ਦ ਔਨ ਦ ਅਬਾਊਟ ਦੈਟ ਟੌਪਿਕ ਐਂਡ ਦੈਨ ਯੂ ਹੈਵ ਟੂ ਰਾਈਟ ਅ ਸਪੀਚ um this there sometimes it's in english and sometimes in punjabi and they have competitions so a really amazing way of how we can uh, train our new generation to become prachariks to spread the message of guru nanak dev ji maharaj with the world and um, so it's really nice how all the children participate today and thank you by vijay singh as well but particularly the children how they speak with confidence um so we couldn't show amriya kaur's video um for some reason it hasn't turned up on on the instagram at the bottom where i can choose so apologies for that so hopefully um it be uploaded uh, try to make one video and upload it onto youtube so you can see the children there talking about guru arjan dev ji maharaj and thoughts on guru arjan dev ji maharaj ji di as well so i really advise um black like advice all the other children who are watching uh research about um your gurus um and try to write down just like uh, um the children done write down what you've read and put it in your own words uh, and share that you might share it with your family share it when you get when the classes start back at the gurdwara sahib or if you get time on sunday at the gurdwara sahib um or just make a video and put it up on youtube or you can come on instagram live for example here and share and it's a really good way of raising our confidence so when all of you young ones become become older you'll be really really confident at sharing the message of sikhi with everybody and spreading that love that guru nanak dev ji maharaj gave and that message which can help all of humanity ji ka ji bahut dhanwad sare da so thank you very much um we had um benji gurmeet kaur saying why guru made everything so um aap uh, heat then him then what uh so i didn't understand the last part sorry benji so i think uh, why guru made everything i think so meaning that he could make the heat go away i think that was what benji is saying so bahut dhanwad uh to them uh to benji for that message um uh, any other messages which are given uh, do, do, do. um so yeah oh no, i don't think there's any more messages so bahut dhanwad sare da uh i think our time got f- one or two minutes if anybody wishes to add upon that uh, or any questions regarding guru arjan dev ji maharaj um otherwise i'll share a quick story just on our way out um uh, so as we just leaving i can share a quick story so gandeep singh talwar it says why ji khal so why guru ji ki fateh um bahut dhanwad ji so if anybody has a question about guru arjan dev guru arjan pasha ji de jeevani ja shid di bare koi sawal hove question um ja tusi kuch share karna chahunde ba guru arjan dev ji maharaj ji modam welcome was everybody is thinking I uh, share a quick story as we are a bit uh, tight for time um because the hour is about to finish um guru arjan dev ji i want to do know these days the panch pere se oh okay veer ji we talking aaj apna topic is about guru arjan dev ji maharaj uh, we'll do a general question and answer tomorrow theek hai ji veer ji ta wo main kar lunga tomorrow kar lunga gandeep singh ji so you can uh, ask those general questions um tomorrow so today we keep up a guru arjan dev ji maharaj so guru arjan dev ji pasha de ਜੇ ਲਿੰਕ ਚ ਕੋਈ ਜੀ ਹੈਗਾ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਜੀ ਬਹੁਤ ਧੰਨਵਾਦ um so there was a, a story shared to um uh, with myself by Pai Amrik Singh ji who is a chaplain at Heathrow airport 
ਕੀਪ ਰਿਪੋਰਟ ਤੇ ਉਹ ਕੰਮ ਕਰਦੇ ਪਾਈ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਤਾਂ ਦੇ ਸੈਡ ਇਨ 2011 um this is september he shared the story so this story is from probably 2011 june guru uh, it was guru arjan dev ji maharaj ji uh, shahid din so guru arjan maharaj ji shahid din manona si apne airport de vich heathrow airport in london and this this the pai amrik singh who was in charge of of this program um they him and then is a team of other six they got together and they got ice creams and they got cold drinks so unhone ice cream leke thande jede drink ya soda leke ta unhone ne vandne shuru kar dete they did distributed so they went on the buses around the airport uh they went on around the airport itself and they were distributing ਇੱਕ ਬੱਸ ਸੀ ਜਿਹੜੀ 에어ਪੋਰਟ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਲੰਘ ਰਹੀ ਸੀ ਸੋ ਇਜ਼ ਅ ਬੱਸ ਗੋਇੰਗ ਫਰ ਦੀ 에어ਪੋਰਟ ਅਮ ਬਾਈ ਅਮਰੀਕ ਸਿੰਘ ਐਂਡ ਹਿਸ ਟੀਮ ਅਮ ਦੇ ਗੋ ਔਨ ਦ ਬੱਸ ਟੂ ਟੂ ਗਿਵ ਫ੍ਰੀ ਆਈਸ ਕ੍ਰੀਮਸ ਟੂ ਐਵਰੀਬਡੀ ਟੂ ਮਾ ਗੁਰੂ ਅਰਜਨ ਦੇਵ ਜੀ ਪਾਸ਼ਾ ਜੀ ਇਸ ਗੁਰਪੁਰਬ ਅਮ ਐਂਡ ਦ ਰੀਜ਼ਨ ਫੋਰ ਦੈਟ ਇਜ਼ ਟੂ to um show this one is to raise awareness and to show how that tera kiya mitha lage how how guru arjan dev ji maharaj accept what vai guru ji did uh, sweetly and how he remained in chardi kala to celebrate that spirit to celebrate that message um some six they uh, share sweet uh, sweet drinks or ice cream um in the modern day um with the, the public just to raise awareness of the gurpur and just to share that message of tera kiya meetha lagge um and how that we can respond to hatred with sweetness we can respond to anger with sweetness and that sweetness comes from simran that sweetness comes from gurbani um and linking ourselves to maharaj So as they given these ice creams this uh, one english lady if mori see the one ice cream laya but they weren't just given these ice creams by themselves they also given a leaflet about what guru arjan dev ji's guru prab is all about so narna she did then bar ek ohna ne ek leaflet banaya si ta ishtiyaru nana vand rahe si so what happens next so this lady takes the leaflet and she takes an ice cream says thank you and that was the that was the, the, the last time she saw any of those six At the bottom of the leaflet there was a telephone number um of for further information and that's by Amrik Singh Ji's number from who was a chaplain at Heathrow Airport. And Pai Sahib told me that he had a phone call that evening or Sharmano phone aaya Pai Sahib Ji no to ohi gori si was that in white English lady and she said to Pai Sahib that that morning she was in the bus she was feeling very very sad bahut kande main pareshan mehsoos kardi si and she goes in my mind i said there's no good people in this world kande mere manch phorna aaya fir zindagi de vich koi changi insaan hai nahi but she goes as soon as uh, i saw these people with turbans and beards come to me and give me free ice cream and a free drink i for how much are you charging kinne paise lagne ya and they said it's free in moftia we giving it out of the kindness of our hearts because our faith we are marking guru arjan dev ji maharaj ji shidi then martyrdom day and for further information have this leaflet she goes then she goes perhaps not all people are bad there might be some good people in this world she was actually feeling very sad because she was married but her marriage had sadly um she had got separated and um, she had gone through a very hard and tough time that she was going through a divorce and she goes she was feeling very depressed very sad it was very unfortunate what had what had happened and so she was feeling very angry there's no kind people in the world how when she saw the six and uh, who were marking guru arjan dev ji did then she thought actually these people are really sweet they are very kind she came home and she read the leaflet ghar aake kan mein ishtihar padhya and when she read it she goes it changed my life she goes if i had not read about guru arjan dev ji maharaj I was planning to commit suicide today. I was planning to end my life which is really bad. She goes ma apna ma aaj main apni khud khushi kar lani si. Par jadon main Guru Arjan Dev ji maar shahidi bade sunya padhya leaflet vich when she read about Guru Arjan Dev ji she goes it changed her life. She made her realize that dukh de vich vi sukh mil sakda je as apni soch nu changi rakhiye. that if we got good thinking if our thinking we see maharaj na jude sari soch rabbi soch hove if we see i try to see life from vai guru ji's perspective from vai guru ji's way and if we trust maharaj and say wo jo maharaj karde changa hi karde ya 
that life, even bad experiences, can we can go through them with the sweetness of Maharaj. She goes, thank you so much to Guru Arjan Dev Ji. Guru Arjan Dev Ji saved my life today. So it's a really, really important that we share the message of our Gurus with, with the world. Um, and hopefully, you know, in, in certain cases, it can save somebody's life or transform somebody's life for the better. So hopefully you enjoyed that story. That story is on uh, the blog, malvisingh.blogspot.com. Um, if you type in Heathrow Airport, Guru Arjan Dev Ji, um, in the search, if that story comes up, if you want to share that story with anybody, um, you're more than welcome. Tika Ji, bo bo Arjan Dev Ji Pasha, what we end the show by saying Tan Guru Arjan Dev Ji uh, five times. Tan means great Tan. Tadda Tippi Nana. Tika Ji? Tan. So Tan Guru Arjan Dev Ji Maharaj, Sare Panjwari, Sare Piyarna Tusvi, Jirakar Apkapra Jitte Tite Tusi Vekriya, whoever's watching this, if you can also repeat uh, uh, as well with me and we end the show um, uh, that way. Tan Guru Arjan Dev Ji 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 Last time Tan Guru Arjan Dev Ji Vaheguru Ji Ka Khalsa Vaheguru Ji Ki Fateh